can't stop binge eating? In this video, you're going to know the main reason why you keep binge eating and the method on how you can actually stop for good. If you haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button and the little bell to be notified every time I post a new video with advice on how to elevate your mindset. Now, I overcame binge eating years ago by using this exact method that I'm going to share with you today. So let's get into it. Now, I'm not here to give you any nutrition advice because here is the secret. It's not about the food. In fact, binge eating is actually a symptom and not the cause. You see, everything in life has a cause and an effect. Many of the health professionals today try to treat the symptom by giving you some form of medication to treat the issue. However, they haven't gone to the root cause of your problem. And the cause starts in here, in your mind. So first, this is why you keep binging. This is the binge restrict cycle. It all starts with restriction. You have restricted thoughts about food. Maybe you're dieting. Maybe you're skipping meals. Maybe you count calories. Naturally, your mind is so preoccupied with all these thoughts around food, thinking about what you're going to eat, how much you're going to eat. And your body starts to produce these intense cravings, particularly around the foods that you perceive as off limits. Now, the body's natural response to your intense cravings is to binge eat or overeat. So you go into the kitchen and you grab the first bottle box or bag of whatever you can find in the moment and your body feels this immediate sense of relief as you're eating because you've been depriving it all day and in the moment when you're eating it's easy but as soon as you stop eating that's when the fear kicks in you start feeling guilty feeling ashamed having negative thoughts towards yourself you'll say things like never again and you'll start tomorrow just to find yourself right back where you started in the restriction phase now if this is resonating with you hit that like button and let me know in the comments so now that you understand that this is the cycle that keeps you binging, it's not enough to stop because you see, you're trying to stop binge eating by controlling the food that you eat or how much you eat or when you eat. And that's trying to control from the outside in. But what you really want to do is you want to control from the inside out. So how do you do that? Everything starts in your mind. So you've got to understand how your mind works. Now it all starts with your thoughts. Your thoughts come from your conscious mind. Your conscious mind is your intellectual mind. It's your educated mind. Now in your conscious mind, you have the ability to choose. You have the ability to originate thoughts. It's only when you impress your thoughts upon your subconscious mind that you feel them to be true because your subconscious is your emotional mind, your feelings. Now your feelings are what drive your behavior and your behavior is how you think, feel and act. And that's what creates your personality. And your personality becomes your personal reality. So once you start behaving a certain way, immediately what happens is there's a mental image formed in your mind. That is what you call your self-image. That's what drives you to binge eat. It's that you associate yourself as a binge eater. You see, your mind does what you tell it. You act in accordance to your self-image. So your actions always line up to the way that you see yourself. That becomes a habitual thing. So if you really think about it, you're binge eating. All it is, is a habit. And even though that habit, it's destructive to your life. It's a habit that you got so accustomed to doing, it became a part of your identity. Now, if there is one thing I want you to take from this video, it's for you to ask yourself this question. When you think of yourself, what kind of an image do you get? Because you see, if it's a negative one, that's what's driving your behavior. That's what's driving your habits. And no matter how hard you may try, you cannot outperform the image that you've created in your mind. That's why most people don't get the results that they'd really like to get because of the image that they hold of themselves. So if you want to change your results dramatically and permanently, you've got to change your self-image. All right, now you know the real reason behind your binge eating, but do you really know how you can change your self-image? If you want to know how you can do it from the inside out, check out this video next. Thank you so much for watching. Hit that like button and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.